What's up guys, we're in things here, and today I'm going to be showing you a video on how to download your pictures from either your phone or your camera or anything, any device pretty much, to a PC. Yeah, so um, you need to plug in your charging cable to the either either PC or laptop um, and then you need to plug, I'm using my iPod you need to plug your phone or your iPod or whatever you have in, and I have it set normally it'll pop up here at, and it'll ask you what do you want um, what do you want this to do every time it pops up and I selected I want it to pop up my um, the files on it so, on if you are downloading it from a phone, um, it's going to ask if you want to allow uh, this device to access your photos and videos, and you want to press allow. Always press allow, otherwise this won't pop up. And then you want to go to your um, internal storage of your phone or your iPod or whatever it is. And you want to go to DCIM, which means pictures, basically pic pictures and videos. Then I have two folders because mine is so big. Uh, my iPod pictures are so big. Um, and then I have all my pictures here. My pictures are there. And then I have all my pictures here. Um, so if you want to move them to just to your... Uh, just to your laptop or computer, you wanna minim you wanna click up here, and you wanna right click. You wanna go to new folder, and then you wanna name like the folder um, vacation pictures. And you wanna go here, and if you press, if you click on this one. And then if you press shift, you can go to the last one that you want and go here and you can drag all this to copy. Now, if you just want to copy them, but you still want it on your camera and on everything, you can just do copy pictures and drag it without holding anything. But if you want to move them, you press shift to move. But I just want to copy, so you release. And, it, and it'll copy to your file. Um, and then if you just want to select a certain amount, like certain pictures, like let's say I want this picture, then I want you want to press Control and then hit another picture. Press Control, hit another picture, and then you can click on any picture and drag it and copy to vacation pictures. Now, let's say you want to, you also want to back it up on your. You also want to back it up on like something like an SD card. Well, you have to plug your SD card in first, and then it should pop up. I have it set up so it pops up here, um, but I don't need that folder. So you go to your Apple iPod or whatever you have. You go here, whatever. Same controls. Um, so let's say I want this pi these few pictures of my dog, right? So you click here, and you drag to the SD, and then if you drag here, another folder is going to pop up, as you just saw, and then you copy it to um, the iPod pictures. Now, if you want, I do believe, it, yeah, and that's how you... Um, yeah, that's and to make a new folder on here, you do it the same way by right clicking and then pressing new. And then you go to folder and then it's gonna ask you the name. So pictures and then when you drag you can drag it into this folder. So like I wanna let's say I want this picture, I click it. Oh, a puppy. I click it, drag it, still holding on the click, and copy to pictures. 
Now when I click on it, there we go. There's my puppy. So that is how you move all your videos and pictures and stuff to your um, either an SD card, a hard drive, or just your actual like computer itself. Now I would recommend backing it up, like lo downloading them to your computer, but also backing them up on either a hard drive or an SD card, just to make sure they're like extra secure if you really want to keep the pictures. And then when you're finished, you always want to make sure you go down to the bottom and press uh, safely remove hard hardware and eject media just to make sure none of your file f um, none of your pictures or files get corrupted or anything um, thank you everybody for watching if you liked please um, share and like the video um, if you haven't already please hit the subscribe button down below um, thanks for watching and I'll see you later peace